how to do to you this morning too. Ha! All right, so this group ride today is gonna cover cover some pretty good backcountry roads. I got her in sport in sport uh, throttle response today. We'll see how this works out. Oh, I've got it in, in slip level six. That's why the traction control light is coming on. <laughs> I was wondering, I was like, wait a minute. Let's get it started. Let's get it started in here. Yeah, we got a we got a fairly fairly big group today. Jeez. I think we have we're starting off with eleven. We're picking up two more and another one. I don't know, man. Dude, this key out of range bullshit is about to piss me off. I don't know what what that's all about, but we're riding in a big group today, and that's uh. I think he said a total of like 187 miles. We got two uh, two water crossings that we're gonna do. Damn! Woo! We might not make our uh, water crossings. Oh, that's a pink ass truck. Good grief. You know, if I'm going to keep riding with these guys, I should probably get a headlight protector. I did buy a new windshield though. I did buy it, but they sent me uh, they sent me one for a 2018 model. And by the looks of it, I thought it was going to fit. Took it out of the package and it said, nah, 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 nah. This, this shit don't work. Man, that's 701. Oh my God. I guarantee you, Ed. I'll bet, I'll bet you you're going to be looking at your uh, Pan Am a little sideways after you get that 701. That 701's going to spoil you. It's going to spoil you. Kind of like the Tenere has done to me. I could get down to be buried in. Oh, I can afford that. I can definitely afford that. Another thing that I'm doing today different is normally I ride with the throttle response in street mode because it is very smooth. The off-road throttle response is just, that's, I don't know, that's something that I probably should have used just for mud, but I, I don't really like it. I've got it in the uh, sport throttle response now, and it is a little on the jerky side, like going slow like I am right now, uh, but once you get up past about 45, 50 miles an hour, it, it rolls on pretty smooth. On the trails, ah, oh, hell no, I ain't putting it in sport mode. Nah, not unless I had some really wide open trails with not a whole bunch of whoops in it. I 
that's flowing a little on the fast side. That's a lot of water flowing. It's flowing pretty good. Yeah, it is. A lot of force. Yeah. I didn't know until we got down here. That, that is a nice bike, though. I like that. Be in a helmet. No shenanigans on this ride, is there? No. Damn, this 701's pretty damn quick. Holy shit, biscuits. To, up to his seat. This way. This way, this way, this way. This way. This way. This way. Okay, so we saved it. Look at there. You should have seen all the water that came out of this bike. This bike went completely in the water and of course I missed it. But the XR 650L. What a beast. Damn. Damn. 
Hi there, big old thing. Jeez. Fayetteville, Texas. Well, we ain't in any other state, but for those of you who are out of state, yeah, we're in Fayetteville. Yeah, we just had some uh, had some lunch. Now we're going to start making our way back to the house. All right, we'll see y'all whenever we get back on the road. But yeah, we got we got quite the crew today. Okay, so this is gonna be our next water crossing. <laughs> We're gonna give this one a shot. The bridge is out, so I've heard that it's fairly shallow, and that's, that's what we're gonna do. Um, yeah. And we'll see how that goes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, I appreciate you guys for tuning in. I hope you like these group rides because I love them, and I'm gonna keep going on them. Um, not every, not every weekend, although here, that's the way it's been every damn for the past three weekends. So, yeah, I'll keep posting them. Uh, if you're local, hit me up on Instagram or just go to the hard <laughs> acronym. It's a hard, uh, YouTube, YouTube, no, Facebook group and ask to join. Hey, wait a minute. Where'd everybody go?